have shelf drinks, concert teas, and oysters at the brasserie. And I laid in his arms until morning came. Hey, baby, you were wonderful. Well, excitable, I so deeply believed. Too quickly in the flowers and flatteries, yeah. The B80 Mothership by Burl Audio, first released in 2010, has redefined digital audio recording. Combining the best of analog and digital technology, the B80 Mothership can be found in top studios around the world and is widely regarded as the ultimate audio interface. Built on an all class A discrete design with a no compromise philosophy, the Mothership delivers unrivaled clarity, depth, and detail not previously found in digital interfaces. Live production and recording studios have been moving towards the digital realm for years and show no signs of going back. With the release of the Burl B4 Mic Pre A to D daughter card, the mothership can now be used for live sound applications, bringing studio quality sound to the stage. Analog PA systems have a clear sound with pleasant non-linearities. Analog systems have a simple workflow and aren't susceptible to software malfunctions that can cripple a live sound production. However, analog sound production does have some limitations. Analog cable is heavy and bulky, and since there are many analog components and connections, there are many possible failure points. With analog consoles, you don't have digital recall, a wonderful convenience people have become accustomed to. And analog hardware effects take up lots of rack space and budget. On the other hand, digital audio has a relatively small physical footprint. Digital cable weighs much less than analog. You have recallability, and you can network audio, rather than being confined to point-to-point -point analog connectivity. But digital audio can sound harsh, grainy, or weak in comparison to analog. Often, cheap circuits are found in standard stage boxes with integrated circuits and off-the-shelf op-amps. While they may provide a nice margin for manufacturers, this leaves performers and the crowd with a less than desirable experience. Mic pre's are typically thin sounding and the conversion is subpar. Bringing the best of both analog and digital together in one box, the B80 Mothership is the ideal solution for bringing richness and clarity to live digital sound production. On May 31st, 2019, Burl Audio set out to prove that the best of both worlds is possible. We put on a show called A Feast of Friends at the Rio Theater in our hometown of Santa Cruz, California, featuring 15 musicians playing a total of 22 songs with a wide variety of styles including opera, rock, soul, and bossa nova. To make this possible, we utilized two B80 motherships and one B16 mothership for a total of 52 inputs and 20 outputs. We used the BMB4 motherboard with Wave SoundGrid connectivity and recorded all inputs to two separate computers for redundant recording. Our friends at Prairie Sun Recording, who have been using the mothership in their studio for years, also own a live sound company called Prairie Sun Live. We thought they would be the perfect crew to team up with for the show, so we worked closely with Travis Strain, Prairie Sun Live Sound Engineer, to incorporate the mothership as a stage box for the first time ever in conjunction with industry standard Digico consoles. Travis mixed the show on the Digico SD7, our front of house console. Burl audio engineer Kevin Columby ran monitors from stage left using the Digico SD10. Hey, the little boy, I see you feeling out of place. Clothes, but you can't hide it in your face. You were tough and you were strong, it is the way you're taught to live. Man, it must be tough to live like that when you know you're sensitive. On stage, we ran two B80 motherships. The first mothership chassis was filled with 10 B4 Mic Pre A to D cards for our first 40 inputs. The second mothership chassis included two additional B4 cards and two BDA8 output cards, which we fed to our monitor amps. 
Both motherships were connected to a gigabit switch via the BMB4 motherboards with Wave SoundGrid technology and provided a total of 48 inputs and 16 outputs. At front of house, we had the B16 mothership loaded with the B4 Mic Pre A to D card and the BDA4M output card. The B4 was used to capture a pair of room mics back at front of house for our recording, and the BDA4M fed the mains amplifiers. Once again, this B16 used the BMB4 motherboard with Wave Sound Grid and was connected to our network. One of the coolest things on that show was the BX5 transformer in the uh, B16 I had at front of house, which I didn't even know was there when we started. And then Kevin came up to tell me, he was like, hey, you know, this isn't even on yet. And he clicked it on and I was like, whoa, what'd you do? And, you know, he clicked it off real quick. He was like, oh, I just flipped this transformer on. And as soon as he clicked it off, it was night and day. Like the sound that it brought to that system was unreal. And I was like, dude, turn that back on right now. And, you know, didn't, didn't go back after that for the rest of the show to really see what it was without. So having that was a huge plus, being able to get that kind of tone and warmth on the main left, right. The B4 Mic Pre A to D input card features four channels of mic or line analog to digital conversion with XLR connectivity, an all Class A circuit featuring the Burl Audio Next Gen BOP A14 proprietary op amps, and the new BX6 input transformer on every channel. The B4 also features an ADC filter select that you can change via a jumper if desired. With four inputs per card, you can achieve a total of 40 inputs per B80 chassis. The BDA8 output card features eight channels of digital to analog conversion with Tascam style DB25 connectivity, an all Class A circuit, and the Burl Audio Next Gen BOP A14 proprietary op amps. The BDA8 also features a DAC filter select that you can change via a jumper if desired. One chassis can power up to 64 channels of BDA8 outputs. The BDA4M output card features a four channel mix and mastering DAC with XLR connectivity, a choice between the Burl Audio Next Gen BOP A14 or BOP A11 proprietary op amps, a switchable BX5 output transformer, and the same stepped attenuator found on the B2 Bomber DAC. This output card also features a DAC filter select that you can change via jumper if desired. Each mothership in our setup was connected to the network via the BMB4 motherboard, which features one sound grid ethernet port, two BNC word clock outputs, and one BNC word clock input. The BMB4 supports 64 channels in and out at 44.1, 48, 88.2, and 96 kilohertz sample rates. Burl Audio and Burlacticus Recording Company wanted to showcase some of the artists that we have worked with over the years from Santa Cruz and Los Angeles. We had a rhythm section consisting of drums, bass, percussion, guitars, keyboards, and a horn section, with a rotating cast of singers who sang lead and backing vocals. We ran all microphones to an analog snake on stage, connected directly to the XLR inputs on the B4 daughter cards in the mothership, which we used as our stage box for the show. You can see our mic list here. We used a total of 42 microphones, ranging from your standard SM57 and 58, all the way up to the Neumann U87. Our monitors were run from stage left by Kevin, who also controlled the gain of the B4 mic pre's. Everything was easily connected to the sound grid network using a gigabit ethernet switch. All inputs were routed to the Digico SD10 console, which ran our monitor mixes, and simultaneously routed to the SD7 at front of house, where Travis mixed the show. In addition to both consoles, all inputs were routed to two separate computers, which we used to record the show redundantly. We will be releasing a live double LP of the show through our record label, Berlacticus Recording Company. At front of house, Travis mixed the show on the Digico SD10 and utilized the BDA4M daughter card to feed the front of house monitor amps. 
At stage left, Kevin ran monitors for the musicians, running a total of 10 mixes, utilizing the BDA-8 outputs from the B80 chassis on stage. In our experience at a feast of friends, everyone was thrilled with the sound quality in the audience and on stage. Setup was quick and easy, and the system performed as solid as a rock. The monitors were clear and sounded incredible, helping the musicians give their best performance. The mothership has been embraced by recording studios around the world for years. And now, with the B4, Mic Pre, and A to D converter, the mothership is the perfect solution for live music venues, bringing the sound of the best studios in the world to the stage. <laughs>